Neil, you want to let him work out with us? He can hold the camera. Sure. We need a good camera guy. He gets all the good angles. He goes, comes from up top. You're not gonna slow me down, right? Huh? You're not gonna slow me down, right? Slow me down? No, I mean, I hope not. Are you scared? I mean, I'm a little under the weather, so yeah, I'm a little worried. You don't have to do this. I have to. I like starting with these. But what we're trying to do is get some longer laps. Like, because you know Bobby's already a wide person, you know what I mean? So we gotta feel it inside. But we're trying to get his lats to be as long as possible. If you notice, our lats don't just stop up here. It goes all the way, you can actually feel it as he's squeezing, all the way down to here. But his lats actually hit right here. So if we can get it to pull all the way, we can get it to extend some more. So we're trying to develop some more muscles in there. So even on the negative, we're going real slow. Get a good stretch, get a good stretch up, yeah. Good up, you got more in, there you go. So like reach forward, reach forward in. And I'm gonna give him some four reps so here. As we open the last, we're filling in the, the little blanks. So squeeze down, slowly come up. Use your lats, use your lats. See, he's engaging and getting hungry. Two more like that. Hold down there. Now put your chest up and use your lats. Use the lats, use the lats, all the way, all the way. One more like that. Engage. Engage, chest up now, and use your lats. As long as possible, you're trying to get as much all the way to the stretches. Not yet, not yet, not yet. There you go. Um, when we do low rolls, when we do the low rolls, it's gonna be the same thing. We're gonna put the pad on the thing, and we're gonna do this. Because the first movement in the back in our rear lap spread is what? This. It's not just this. It's this. A lot of people don't look at it. Bodybuilding is a show, so you have to show the, the lap pull down. First thing we do, we set, so we pull our hands up. So why I push? I push you forward because this because the judges are below us. So the first thing we do is this. See what I'm doing? So if I push you forward, you're doing this. Then when you come down, it's the knots they're looking for, and then the rest. But you're still leaning, right? So that's why some people do lat pull down like this. It's this because this is the double the bicep. We're pulling down into the pose. We're opening up. We're not squeezing. We're opening up. There's a lot of different. You hear mountain dog that say, stop doing these, this guy, it's open up. So everything we're doing today is about how we pull. So for example, this right now, this is my spinal erector movement. This is the first beginning movement they said, all right guys, we're, we're last breath. So I'm going, rid of the bicep. See what I'm pulling? Some guys do this. No, I do. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. 
I'm reaching for it. But the judges are behind you, right? Come on! 
looking sick. Looking real sick. You know what I'm saying? Looking sick, looking solid. Even with three people right now, you just make sure we keep it going. It don't necessarily have to be heavy weight. Make sure you're getting all that squeeze and y'all rotation is fast. If you got somebody in your group and he's not moving at the same rotation, get him out. You gotta get him out. Get him out. You gotta push past what you think you can do. That's what a good training partner is. Take you past those limits. Oh yeah. Yeah. 
so it's August 14th. Uh, we just hit a back day. The intensity is getting dialed up every day. Every day we're in here trying to think of what our goals are. Uh, I got some goals in 2020. I'm trying to push this guy to do some stuff in 2020. So we're trying to get bigger and stronger. Uh, trying to push the envelope of what our bodies are physically capable of doing every time we're in the gym. And we're having a lot of fun doing it too. Yeah, uh, my focus really is, you know, it's, it's been really good because, you know, it's really hard to find someone that, that really wants to compete and train and and not just be on the stage, but actually put the, push the limits in the gym. And um, it's been a few, good few weeks um, working with Bobby, and I'm really just focused really on and excited that he'll be in another stage and looking like a different person next year. So every time we train in here, it's been like, for me, it's reliving how I used to train, which is which was very hard to duplicate over the past few years, and that's that's honestly speaking because um, the intensity and type of training I'm so used to. But coming here and it's like it's like reliving and coming back to that. And um, every week we've not had honestly not had a bad one workout. bad workout, not a bad workout. Even arms, like I'm not even lying to you. I would sort of guy like it's been every training has been two shirts being changed. Yeah. You know, literally ringing out every shirt. So today we finished everything off to the end. Um, pull, squeeze. Um, when you're going to see the YouTube video, when he pops it up, when you think you're going to when they should expect that. It'll be up next week. Next it'll week? Be up. Good. You'll see a lot of our pulling and squeezing and focusing on lat spreads and um, mid back. Um, he's got a lot of frames to fill out, so he's going to go up to a, another weight class. For me, it's just still having fun, but I'm, I love the process. We were, we were, you know, we did a lot of stuff at the beginning that was my muscle connection, trying to set the tone as far as feeling the muscle contract, and then as we got deeper into the workout, the intensity got dialed up, the weights got dialed up, uh, and it's just a perfect blueprint for a workout. Every workout should be like that. Uh, it should just be scaling up as you get towards the end. It should never start to peter off. So the energy is great in the gym right now. Uh, you guys should come down, check it out. If you haven't already been, been in here, it's contagious. So uh, A lot so. of good things coming. I wanted to say maybe um, we're going to have a Q&A coming up soon. Q&A, seminars, we're going to do a lot of different stuff. So 600 uh, Main Street, Muscle Link Gym. Stay tuned.